Today's entertainment time. Here's Brooke. Today's entertainment report brought to you by Stan's brand new season of Yellowstone. Now streaming only on Stan. Well, it's the story of a talking piglet who thinks he's a sheepdog that went on to become an Australian film classic. And it was on this day 25 years ago that Babe first burst onto the big screen and into the hearts of millions right around the world, even picking up an Oscar along the way. To mark the special anniversary this morning, we catch up with the film's legendary writer-producer George Miller and one of the stars, the glorious Magda Zabansky. La, la, la. La, la, la. If it's not a duck that thinks it's a rooster, it's a pig that thinks it's a dog. <laughs> <laughs> Move along there, you... You, uh, big buttheads. <laughs> Take me back to 25 years ago when Babe first hit cinemas. <laughs> Do you ever think that a, a movie about a little pig who thinks he's a sheepdog, would go on to be as big a blockbuster as what it was. As a matter of fact, when we went to first get the rights to the book, both the author's lawyers and our lawyers laughed when, when they said, hey, you sure you want to buy the rights to a book about a talking pig? And we said, yes. It's wacky, you know, that's George Miller. <laughs> it just was the little pig that could, you know? It just kept going, and it, it, it's so beautifully made. Babe, huh? you wait here. Aren't pigs alone? Not live ones. <laughs> Sorry, dear. Only dogs and cats inside the house. Why? That's just the way things are. The use of animatronics at that time was pretty revolutionary, wasn't it? What challenges did you have when you were trying to essentially make a pig talk back in 1995? It, it was tricky, but that was part of the excitement of it as well. To, to be working in, in new technology. And it not only got nominated for Academy Award but uh, for, for visual effects, but also it won. And the Oscar goes to Scott E. Anderson, Charles Gibson, Neil Scanlon, John Cox for Babe. It must have been a lovely time on set. Mostly we were there with the animals and, and the animal handlers. And um, it was like, making a film in a zoo. It was the most bizarre experience. And the animals, I mean, they were extraordinary. The dogs, all under a guy, a guy called Carl Lewis Miller, who just had an affinity for animals, understand, and they still had to get the best out of them, almost by loving reinforcement, really. That was the most impressive thing, particularly with dogs. And then he got to understand, and a whole team of Australians got to understand how to work with pigs, who who have become my favourite animal, not because of that, but because I understand how bright they are. Pigs are definitely stupid. Excuse me. No, we're not. Good heavens. Now, you've made a lot of big movies in your career. What is it about Babe in particular that you love? When you tell a story like this, uh, it engages the child in the adult and the adult in the child. It's a really beautiful film in every way. I mean, the sentiments of it are beautiful, um, but you know, an unprejudiced heart, which is Babe. Um, and it's beautifully shot and it's beautifully written. And, and it's got all of those classic elements to it. Oh, beautifully done. I can't tell you how grateful I am to y'all. Hey, can you do me a favor? Can you make us a Babe 3? You never know what happens, Brooke. You, know. you never know your luck in the big city, as a pig or otherwise. <laughs> That's exactly right, yeah. That little pig. That'll do. gorgeous film. I love it so much. And if you haven't seen the movie in a while, I suggest that you snuggle up on the couch and watch it all over again or maybe show it to your kids for the first time mm. because it is on Netflix so you can stream it right now. And that face. Oh. And Such a cute la, la, la. face. OK, Ali's going to... It's now time has come for Ali to give her impersonation of Babe, everyone. So if you'd stop what you're doing, stop eating your Weet-Bix kids. <laughs> That's over to Alison Langdon. Here's the microphone. <laughs> Oh, I don't, I don't mean the song. <laughs> that is a very different babe. <laughs> I meant la la la. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's 
sounded very sweet in my head. <laughs> it's cute. I liked it. I oh, like it. Thank you. That'll be in our thank heads you. all day. Good. Well done, Ali. I hope well no one was real. eating a bacon and egg roll while that was. <laughs> no, exactly. Oh. No, it does oh. put you off bacon a little bit. Only for a little bit, though. <laughs>